Hey everyone, it's Tuesday. Excuse the wet hair. Um, I guess I'll just talk about the theme, um, which is books that you had trouble getting through or didn't particularly like. Um, and I have two to talk about. Both of them, I know of a lot of people that really love them, um, so don't let my opinion stop you from reading them. Um, the first one is Octavia Nothing um, by M.T. Anderson. If you read John's blog or watch his videos, you know he thinks it's like the best book since Huck Finn. But um, I had a lot of trouble getting through it. Um, I did read the whole thing eventually. It took me like a year, but um, I did. It's historical fiction, and it's written in the style um, of writing from that time period. Um, so that's really interesting. Um, it's about um, a slave, but not the typical plantation slave like you may have read about before. Um, it's about this like strange group of scientists, um, and they're doing like experiments on um, the slave um, to see if black people can learn the same way as um, white people, and so every aspect of his life is measured in some way. Um, yeah. I don't remember too much, but um, you should definitely give it a try. Um, the writing is very good. You can tell that even if you don't like it. Um, and you should definitely try it. Okay. Second is The Looking Glass Wars um, by Frank Bedour. Um, this one I didn't finish yet. I got that far and then I stopped. Um, I'll go back to it eventually, but um, not yet. <laughs> Um, it's basically a retelling of Alice in Wonderland. Um, it's darker and more violent, um, than the original. Um, I think it might be more of, like, a guy's book. I kind of hate it when people classify them like that, but, um, I think it may be, because I didn't really like it. Um, but I have heard a lot of people that do, so you should try it, too. Um, okay, I think I'm going to stop there because I'm planning to go to Barnes & Noble today. Um, so if I do, then I'll show you what I get. And also, my library finally has um, Harry Potter and the Deathly Hallows, so I'm going to go pick that up too. Okay, I'm back. Um, I got Harry Potter, like I said. Um, and then I got some books from Barnes & Noble. Um, they're going to be graduation presents, um, so I don't technically get them until the 30th, but that's really soon anyway, so um, okay. A Little Friendly Advice by Shubin Vivian. I can never remember how to say it. Um, Pride and Prejudice and Zombies. Um, I think I mentioned that one before. <laughs> I can't wait to read it. Um, Willow by Julia Hoven. Um, that Genevieve just reviewed. Um, A Map of the Known World by Lisa Ann Sandal. Um, that sounds really good. Um, and Speak, um, which mostly everyone has read, but I haven't, so I thought it was time. Um, and there's just a couple other things I wanted to say about the theme and um, the books that I forgot. First, that the theme was suggested by Mallory Spiderwick. Um, thank you for that. Um, I'll put a link to her channel in the sidebar. Um, um, for Octavia Nothing, there's a sequel to it um, that's out already. Um, I'm not sure if there's going to be more, but, um, so if you like the first one, you can read the second one. And The Looking Glass Wars are part of a series, or it might be a trilogy, I'm not sure. Um, the third one comes out later this year, so again, you can read more if you like it. Okay, um, see you tomorrow, Chelsea.